Hey, what's up everybody? It's the Untouchable Wolf, and if you're new to my channel, please make sure to subscribe for more Elder Ring how-to videos and live streams, and thanks so much for support. It truly does mean a lot. So I'm be showing you how to use the Divine Beast Frost Stomp. Now you get this by defeating the Divine Beast Dancing Lion. So let me show you right now on the map. So you wanna make sure to you know, go to the DLC area, work your way up, and defeat the Dancing Lion right here the divine beast area and then you will get to um get his remembrance and you can turn the remembrance in for the divine beast frost stomp so you see the fp cost right here is 18 and i did apply the ash of war to my uchi katana which made it um have the frost build up as well we're going to be using the uh, frost stomp so remember it does cost uh, fp cost is 18 so all you have to do is press the left trigger and i like this area where i'm at because it's a really open area to test out weapons so and um let me show you this is live gameplay live commentary so silly things can happen so i'm just going to tap the left trigger so you can see the difference between when you uh just tap it and then when you um hold it and charge it up i'm just tapping the left trigger tapping it so you can actually spam this um, Ash of War as well. All right, so now I'm gonna hold the left trigger. Holds in it. Holds in it. So you see the difference here. So we're gonna test it out with some enemies here. Remember, this is a live gameplay. Silly things can happen. They know me well here. So we're gonna do a combination of like tapping the left trigger and then holding it. It does take a little bit of stamina when you charge it up. Really, really cool effect here. The Divine Beast Frost Stomp. Like Untouchable Wolf. Kind of spamming it right here. What up, guys? What did I do to you? I like the heavy, the charge stump. Here, I'm spamming it. Spamming it. And that's what I'm talking about. Let's go. This is how you use the Divine Beast Frost Stump. So if you have any questions, let me know in the comment section down below. And if you found my video helpful or entertaining, please make sure to give me a like rating and subscribe for more Elder Ring how-to videos and live streams. And thank you so much for your support. It truly does mean a lot. Thanks for watching and take care. And more wolf videos be coming soon. Later. Peace. Ooh.